Hey everybody, welcome back to the Super Throw Bros YouTube channel. I am Boldega. Bilo is over here. And I am continuing on my quest to find the Versus Seeker. And I am training with my Versus Seeker because I don't know how he did it, but he jumped way ahead of me in levels and his Pokemon are almost level 50 and mine are not. Well, it's because I have rarely had six Pokemon throughout the whole thing, and you started your whole game off with six pretty quickly. We've established this. Yeah, I, I still don't agree with that, but okay. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure that, I mean, based on how many Pokemon you have had, um, you've consistently, uh, other up until just recently, you've consistently always had more... Um, uh, more Pokemon than me. I'll, I'll agree with you. I don't know. I know I've had it for a while. It's only my... It's only it. my second item down in the... Did you get it? Mm-hmm. Vermilion. Which one was it in? Vermilion. Okay, now how do I use this thing? Oh, there we go. There we go. Level 29 Pidgeotto. That's about time. I think that's the the biggest one I've fought so far. The oldest. Uncouth person, she says. Yep. Ratata. Oh boy, a level 16 Ratata. Oh my goodness. However, will I defeat you? Wait, quick attack! Screw you! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking rat bastard. Uh, the picnicker above um, Vermilion. Yeah. has a uh, level 29 um, Pidgeotto. Two level 29 Well, Pidgeotto. this is a Picnicker above Vermilion. That just paralyzed me, because of course it would. 200 experience. Woo. Why does... <laughs> My... Pokemon just get paralyzed every freaking battle. They're like, no, I don't want to fight for you. Six eighty five was not bad for that one. I mean, this is the first time I've ever using it, so I think this is just their first level up, and they're only like, I mean, I guess this guy's level twenty two, but. It's also different people that will fight you each time, too. Like, sometimes the same guy over and over will fight you, but, it, it, like, sometimes the person that you thought was going to fight you won't, it, like, won't have the little exclamations over their head. They'll be like, meh, I don't feel like fighting this time. Yeah.
I mean, this is still like, I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully it'll get better. Well, I'm going to be able to tell you here pretty quick whether it is them leveling up or not because I will have gone through most of these guys more than once, you know? Yeah. And I think after this Vermilion one, I'm going to go back up to uh, the beginning and see how those guys are because I don't quite feel like I want to go try, like, the... Um, bikers yeah well i was i was just about to say hey i'm gonna go try some bikers mostly because like the bikers have all poison type and then i'd end up using you know type advantage and i'm just not quite sure about the, all that and then you know i also am like uh i don't really want to fight a weeping that has explosion or oh yeah that yeah That'd really mess me up if I lost a Pokemon this far into the game. I'd be like, no. That's why, for the most part, I'm like, meh. Okay, you're you're level twenty. I'll 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 deal with that. Like, it's not killing me. You know what I mean? Like, some of these are like when this guy right here, he's got level sixteen Weedles. His yeah. level 16 Weedles are only worth like 160 XP. I'm like, ah, yeah. that's a waste of time. Um, my whole thing with in a gym is, I'm ca I'm catching like three to five people each time. You know what I mean? And so I have the opportunity to fight as many as five different trainer battles. There we go. Okay, so you do have to give it a little bit of time. Okay. I think that there's a max on them. Um, I don't know 100% just because uh, this time the... Um, the bug catcher didn't want to fight me and he's the one that's been fighting me with a two level 28 um, but the girl with the Pidgeys she has Pidgeotos now mm. and they're level 28 I'm on that road between Saffron and Lavender. Because yeah. there's that line of four trainers. Mm -hmm. They're like back to back. And three of them wanted to fight me, so. Yeah, I think that very top of the biker road where all those guys are is the most concentrated mm -hmm. trainers. Yeah, that'll be... That, I just, that they be were already road. were 40 at that point, and so I can only imagine what they were, what they would be you refighting them. Yeah. That'd be like, if I wanted to get Missy to, like, way level up, that would be, that'd be where I would go, because Missy could one-shot all of them. I'm in the one road between Pewter and uh, uh, Mount Moon. Mm -hmm. And uh, like most of these guys want to fight over and over again anyway. All I have to do is go run down to the Pokemon Center and run back and they are ready to fight again. Mm. Uh, okay, that was not quite worth it. I mean, he did level up a little bit. He went from, like, level 9 to a level 11, so... Mm. Should be training Nader. 
Well, yeah, if I wanted to hyper-train Nader, uh, you know, so that he was her Tranitar, that'd be the way that I want to do it. But I want to get kicking Chicken up to where he's even with everybody. Yeah, I, I, Nader is my, um, uh, uh, Nina King. Oh, not Button. Not That's button. dumb. My bad. Yeah, I, didn't, did not, I did not say Button. Button, Button, who's got the Button? That's right, I've got Button. Oh, -ho. wish me luck. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Did you go to the bicycle road? <laughs> yeah, I went to the bikers. And all of them but one wanted to refight me. Nice. And they're they're like uh upper twenties. Really? Just upper twenties? Yeah, I thought that they were 20s. older than that when we first fought them. No. No. Because, I mean, I, I had just hit level 40 with uh, with Missy uh, through here. Well, I mean, at least it's a consistent level 28 through here. Yeah. I don't think that they're, po like, their Pokemon are definitely not giving me the experience, though, of the, the other trainers. Well, I think so, it's maybe because it's base evolutions, but. Well, there's a couple of these bikers here that have Weezings that give you a thousand experience for killing the Weezing. So, I think overall it might be better just because there's so many of them all in one spot. Um, and they've got the, the wheezings. This has by far been the most productive out of everything I've done so far. But of course, I'm training a lot higher Pokemon than you as well, so... That's uh, twelve hundred experience for one Pokemon. That's yeah, not bad. Nothing to sneeze at. But like I said, I was also doing, you know, Butterfree for nine hundred experience and one shotting him and not getting hit. So. Oh, that's that is true. That is true. Makes a little bit of a difference when you can one shot them and get the experience versus. Yeah. That was an experience for that one, though. It's not terrible. I definitely think it is the base form versus, uh, mm -hmm. you know, it's evolved evolution. form experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It can chicken is 40. I don't like all your smoke screens, coughing. What's that? Yeah, that one battle was actually worth it. It was like 2,400 experience for two wheezings and a coughing. Yeah. Yeah, that, that, 
that whole section with those with those uh, bikers was really good, actually. Um, yeah, I got. Where are you out. trying to hit up now? Um, so I had this idea of going all the way down the bike path. There's not another big concentration on the bike path, but there's all those bird trainers mm -hmm. um, on the other side. You're not and, wrong. And I think there's uh, there's only three of them here, but they're here. And only one of them wanted to fight me because he's a... The other two were a bitch. And then I was going to go across Fuchsia to the road between Fuchsia and, and Lavender because there's another line of bikers that are all really close together that is about as many bikers as what is up there. You're not wrong. I did forget about that over there. And so I think that that's a good like loop and then you can fly back to um, Celadon and take the loop again. And I think, and I think that might be, um, I mean, this guy's Pharaoh is level 29. Yeah. I mean, and Pharaoh being evolved is going to give you more experience in his coughing than I got for 700. Yeah, I got, I got a thousand for the Pharaoh. And because you can walk to most of these places, the, the, thing is recharged by the time you get to each place. There's four people right there. Well, how many people can I get right here? I can get five maybe here. Um, but what about up here? How many are there? Uh, there's four bikers. Right? Okay, there's four bikers right there. Okay, there is a place here on this road that you can get five people. Ooh, and all of them but one want to fight me. Ooh, that is nice. I just got four of the bikers up top that want to fight me here, so. Hmm. Yes, the double trainer with the Hitman Chen and Hitman Lee will fight me again. Nice. I literally just beat them, but we will fight again. Oh, they leveled up a little bit. They went from 29 to 33. Really? None yeah. of these guys are any... I'm fighting the bikers up at the top of the bike path again. None of them are, are any different level. I'm kind of disappointed. But it's okay. But this this will be a good. I I mean I leveled up everybody to level fifty one except for Ali in that one round. Um, but they were all pretty close to level fifty one anyway. Um, so it'll be interesting to see. Um, it'll be interesting to see if. Uh, Or, like, exactly how much experience I get for everybody. 
I think uh, for me, I think once I'm 55 on everybody except for maybe Nader, um, I think that'll be the time where I'm going to be comfortable um, making a run at the Elite Four. I think once everybody's pretty close to level 50, I'll be comfortable to do uh, the rest of my little run through. You've already been to Victory Road, though, so... Oh, no, I could be dead. Oh, no. Okay, never mind. <laughs> what happened? Um... I missed, uh... I missed an attack, and this wheezing has been, um... Like, punishing me because of smoke screens and stuff. And I missed an attack, and he poisoned me, and he toxic me, and I missed, and I was at a point where if he would have done another toxic, it would have killed me. Oh, shoot. That would have been pretty terrible to lose uh, two of them in one session. So that run um, got Ali up to level 51, and then I just used Nader the rest of the time, um, and he got from like he got a couple levels. That's your Nido King, right? Yeah. Ooh, all of the bikers want to fight me. Every single one of them. Very cool. Hopefully they're not all like five levels higher than what they have been. <laughs> That's suck ass. Nope, they haven't changed at all. I wonder if 29 is just the highest that any of these trainers could possibly be. Or maybe there just hasn't been enough time that passed yet. I'm I, I just I'm wondering. I, I've got a couple of different theories on deck right now, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. Yeah. Nope, that doesn't work at all. Uh oh. I was wondering if fighting the same trainer like twice in a session might, you know, like. I mean, honestly, at this point, I might as well. I mean, it might suck ass, but I, I might go to freaking the uh um to victory road and 
run around fighting wild Pokemon until my Versus Seeker is charged and then just fight the couple, the few trainers that are stacked up there. Even though they suck ass and they're hard as fuck. But that wouldn't be good for Nader. I mean, that would be something that I'd have to do. Like, I'd have to train Nader up to 40 or whatever, 43. So that he could be on par with everybody there. Because this is just, I mean, it's going to take forever. It's just not going to cut it for me at this, at this stage of the, at this stage of my levels, other than with, other than with Nader, um, you know, fighting. Well, what is your, what is your total experience on your loop? Oh, fuck if I know. Well, that's something you should probably figure out because then you could determine how many loops it's going to take you to level your Pokemon. Yeah, but I'm also, I mean, you're right. I'm also getting a lot of money doing this too. My whole thing with where I'm at is there's no possibility for anybody to one-shot me. Nobody has explosion. Nobody's going to one-shot me. Nobody's going to, like, come out from behind. Yeah. Well, that's true. But at a certain point, you really got to take some risks. For those big gains. Well, if you were getting any bigger gains than I was, absolutely. But like I'm, I'm pulling 900 instead of 1200. But I'm pulling it twice in a single battle instead of one 1200 battle. If he decides he wants to fight me, yeah. All right, kick a chicken is now up with everybody else. Good. Got to get button up there now. What? Oh, because Butterfree's flying. That's lame. Mm-hmm. Yep. The down. fighting does not work against him very well. Mm -hmm. The first time I have not one-shotted a Butterfree. Huh. I am not okay with this. That sucks. And I'm hurting myself in confusion every single time. Oh, okay, whirlwind somebody out. That's super cool. Tea chicken, huh? Okay. Thundershock, you're dead. Bye. Drill pack. Yeah, drill pack. See ya. Thank you. 
Ooh, as Button gets older, I'm getting closer to being able to just one-shot everybody. Nice. It's nice when I could just do a bite on a sparrow and not have to worry about rock sliding him. Yeah. And I know 50 is a little more experience that you need versus, like, going through your 40s, but I can't imagine that doing five levels in your 50s, I mean, five levels over six Pokemon is different, don't get me wrong, but five levels in your 50s to get to 55 is really going to take all that long. Well, I mean, it's going to take a while. It's going to take a while. Because in the whole loop... Um, in the whole loop, I don't even get one level on a Pokemon. And you fight them all with the same Pokemon? Uh-huh. Okay, I'm... Okay. Well, we don't even have to... Uh, we don't even really have to sign off on this one because we're just going to post-commentate it. Okay. So we'll, okay. we'll sign off well, later. So I saved. Okay, sorry. I'm in the middle of one last battle. Just one more Pokemon, and then I'll be... Then I'll be done myself. Sorry. No, you're good. Oh, come on. That should have been one shot. Jerk. Oh, and then you're going to Fury Attack because you're a jerk face. Why don't you use a Hyper Potion? There we go, Nikki's level 52. It's like three quarters of a level, though. I pulled up Zapdos, and Zapdos is 9,100 to level up from 50 to 51. And that's a legendary. So, like, I wouldn't yeah. expect very many more of the Pokemon other than legendaries would expect more experience per level. Yeah. All right. And... Do you already saved yours? Yeah, I saved. Okay. I'm going to stop now.